Hello, Epic friends. Welcome back for another reading. We are in the book of Hebrews, um, chapter 11. Um, we are going to be continuing chapter 11, starting at verse 23. So make sure you grab your Bible and a journal and a pen so that you can take some notes. And even if you want to mark up your Bible, um, there's a couple of repeating words in here. Um, and I'll emphasize those when I'm reading so that you can underline those and think about those. Um, we, we started with Hebrews chapter 11, which is faith in action, um, is the heading of that um, of these verses. And so um, go ahead and um, find your place. Hebrews 11, starting at verse 23. And um, if you need hit pause to find your spot in your Bible, go ahead and do so and you can hit play when you're ready. All right. Hebrews 11, starting at verse 23. By faith, Moses' parents hid him for three months after he was born because they saw he was no ordinary child and that they were not afraid of the king's edict. By faith, Moses, when he had grown up, refused to be known as the son of Pharaoh's daughter. He chose to be mistreated along with the people of God rather than to enjoy the fleeting pleasures of sin. He regarded disgrace for the sake of Christ as of greater value than the treasures of Egypt because he was looking ahead to his reward. By faith, he left Egypt, not fearing the king's anger. He persevered because he saw him who is invisible. By faith, he kept the Passover and the application of blood so that the destroyer of the firstborn would not touch the firstborn of Israel. By faith, the people passed through the Red Sea on dry land, but when the Egyptians tried to do so, they were drowned. By faith, the walls of Jericho fell after the army had marched around them for seven days. By faith, the prostitute Rahab, because she welcomed the spies, was not killed with those who were disobedient. All right. So go ahead and reread that. Reread those verses. And reread that word, that repeating word, faith. And what faith in God, even though he wasn't seen, what that, what that made possible. All right. And then any thoughts that you have, any things that you were thinking um, as you were reading through. Maybe it's something entirely different, and we love that. So just write those things down, jot those things down, and we'd love to hear about that and talk to you more about that. All right, thanks for tuning in, and we will see you tomorrow.